Okay, so I don't have, I do not have um, a setup right now, but I definitely had an idea to eat some chicken. I don't have no nails on. I'm starving. I worked the shift till 4 o'clock in the morning. But I wanted to do a video of me just eating because, you know, I be seeing videos of people just eating. And I was like, I eat all the time. Let me eat. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out ideas. Continue to send me um to send me anything I may need, anything you may want to see. Gun chewing included. This chicken has been sitting for about 30 minutes. I have not started to eat. So I'm gonna eat backwards. But you better believe the girl is starving. And I got this um sitting on a towel. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to eat it straight out the box because it's my plate today. That's my KFC chicken box. I got the soft kind because I'm kind of tipsy. And I just want to eat. You know? I grabbed a few barbecue sauces. Don't really want that. I want the um, honey mustard. So I got some Chevalier Ranch. See, I'm about to be watching, and I can't see, but I'm finna start. Okay, I'm starving. Your barbecue. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I've been craving this chicken. Look how soft it looks. Make sure I'm standing in front. So now I'm doing the drink. Oh man. And no, I didn't want to really see him eat in silence. But I was like, yo, I'm never going to push out videos. I'm working. Like at first I wasn't working, so I'm working. I eat. When I can, so sometimes when I eat, I'm gonna show, I'm bring it out with me. She must thought I was a barbarian. I'm like, no, we ain't got nothing for that. I kind of wanted churches, but churches chicken be plain as hell. Can anybody relate to that? Anytime I get churches chicken, it's plain. I don't want that. I don't really like all that. I'm gonna eat it. Uh-uh. I can't keep doing that. Uh-uh. <gasps> it's so hot. <laughs> Look at my towel and like my hands lit. Is what I'm recording with. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I work at a bar. I live in Memphis. I work at a bar. And I also sing in a band. And it just feels like my life is changing. Like, I used to be a teacher assistant. I used to be. Like, I hold you type of person. And now I work at a bar. And we're like, I'm supposed to do this. Mm-mm. I eat like a baby, a baby chicken, so you know me. 
hot too. Oh, I thought it been sitting this shit hot. Let me some fresh chicken. Mmm. I usually don't get thighs, so I usually get legs. Had they had honey mustard, all these would have been legs. I don't really like this there. I have a long this video is. I'm gonna send it straight out. I'm not gonna edit. I ain't clipping. I ain't doing shit. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, my girl. Um, I love her so much. What's her name? I'm sorry. I know her name. I definitely know her name. It's like right now her name not here. Hello. Hey, it's somebody too. What's her name? Spirit. I love Spirit. Yo. Can't, why can't I think of one of my favorite words ever? Her name is Spirit. And it's a beautiful name for her because guess what? She is a spirit. She knows it. I watch her all the time, and sometimes, like, randomly, when I think I kind of forgot about ASMR, I go and watch her, and she just kind of, like, gives me inspiration to just keep doing me, because she's living her daily functions, like, sometimes, sometimes you forget, sometimes you don't really want to do nothing but eat, and guess what I'm going to do, and that's what she going to do, record. She gonna record herself eating her meal. Show you plate, have it together. Okay, I'm, I'm leading by example, Spirit. Thank you so much. You really are my biggest influence in the ASMR community. And more to come. Because I've done different things, but I definitely just need to make time. Like, keep time rolling. This is another form of expression. I'm trying to live out. Don't even, don't please, don't judge me. I'm putting this in here because I'm gonna eat this leg and I think I'm done. Yeah, when I took a wait, when I started this video, did I have four pieces of chicken? You know, I feel like Patrick, you know, when Patrick ate uh, his chocolate. Both Patrick and Spongebob got chocolate bar. And Patrick ate his chocolate up fast as fuck. And was looking at Spongebob like, bro, where my chocolate at, man? And he like, bro, you ate it. And I'm like, no, I didn't. I would have known. Yo, did I not just start eating on this video? Had a leg, had a thigh, picked up this leg, and acted like the leg did not exist no more. Like, I'm like, where's my fourth piece of chicken? I'm tired, okay? I'm so after this, I'm going to watch Baddies, and I'm going to take my book back to sleep. That's good. This is good to go. Chipotle ranch. Mm hmm. That's good. Mm. Um, I kind of want to give y'all a little story. Okay. Follow me on TikTok. It's mini underscore haha on TikTok. Um, yeah. So I work at a bar. <laughs> bar store. Um, was it yesterday? Yesterday, two guys walk in. Having relationship issues, I guess. I mean, one of them technically t really does. He's like, man, this girl got a six or seven year old child. 
Like, what do I do? And I'm like, okay, what's the problem? <laughs> He's like, she got a six or seven year old child, but she kind of wasn't trying to tell me. And I'm like, I don't think it wasn't that she was, wasn't trying to tell you. I don't think that's what it was. I think. Wait a minute. When did y'all meet? He was like, we just met today. Mr. Sir. If y'all just met today, you think she gonna throw her child up in your face? Her face? Like, your face? What you think happened in this motherfucker? Like, like, I have my son on my home screen, so. If you see my baby, there ain't no accident. I'm not gonna say this my cousin. Where did she say? He was like, well, I th she said, I feel like you're gonna leave me just like the others. And I feel like she just got PTSD. And the way that these men were making it sound was like she was trying to hide and, and sneak the fact that she had a baby. I don't know. The type of conversations that I go through with the bartender is hilarious because are you serious? And these people be like, a little bit out their mind, so <laughs> literally, cause they drinking. You know, you gotta give people some grace, man. But not too much. You don't give them wiggle room to mess with you and f you over. But you give them grace. Um. So. So, yeah, I don't know. I just. I'm thirsty. Uh uh. Biscuits, I break it up for y'all. <laughs> Don't really like this. And I want the mashed potatoes, but I usually dip my chicken in my mashed potatoes if it was spicy. I just wanted the soft chicken today. As a bartender, it's interesting to hear that men are concerned about little things like that. But damn, guys, why do women always have to be the villain? And women, why do men always have to be the villain? What's going on? Why are we fighting against each other? We don't learn how to love each other soon. I got a scary feeling about the world. I have more bar stories though, like funny ones, like. I'll be ready to go. That's when customers want to come in and sit down and use up dishes. Bring get up out of here. <laughs> I'll be like, do you not know what time it is? Like, you act like, just yesterday, this one lady, I guess she's a good customer, a good paying customer. She walked in when we was closed, chairs up. Everything wiped down. System, the, the system is shut down. This girl walked in and gave us $50 for a bottle of champagne because she's a normal customer. They let her do it. You know, I would have looked at her with the store closed. She better work here. Ask her for that. Girl, get up out of here. So I'm sitting up there looking at our room because it's 3 o'clock in the morning and she in my face talking about some go look for this, go look for that. I ain't never had to go look for it. Nor is it on the list. And if I was here by myself, you wouldn't have got let in. Lucky. Lucky. Girl, get out my phone. Mm hmm Customers be like, have my audacity because they on the they on the town. Girl, the door's closed. It's over. You should have walked in here when it wasn't over. You see that? It looks sus and I can't do it now. Okay. I want to get some mashed potatoes. 
Am I gonna eat them with my finger like a treat? Maybe. Mmm. I need some salt and pepper. Okay. I'm done. That's how I eat my food. I usually only get like a two or three piece. But today, I wanted the four piece. And I really don't want it all eggs. But today, I wanted thighs. That's a whole chicken. Don't worry about that. Let's put your skirt back on. Yeah. That is me eating KFC, guys. I might say this. This is not the worst. That's me eating KFC and talking a little bit. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Snapchat if you want to. All of that is in the description box. And... I'll be back with another video soon. Yeah. Bye, guys.